hi you're welcome to my youtube tutorial today we shall be considering the construction of equal number of circles within a circle so today we shall be dividing the circle into five equal parts and also you can decide the number of parts you can divide the circle so start by drawing a horizontal line and mark the point O and with the required radius will describe the circle. So with this circle obtained, we want to divide this circle into five equal parts. So using the formula 360 divided by number of sides. So that's 360 divided by 5 will get 72 degrees. So with this 72 degrees using our protractor, we'll get these markings and we'll divide the circle into five equal parts. So we need other smaller circles within this large circle, which will be equal, touching the large circle and the smaller circles touching each other. So we'll start by bisecting the angle E O B. So bisecting the angle at that point, we'll do that and it will give us like 36 degrees. That's we'll do that and we'll get it. We extend the line to mark the point F on the circumference. So at E we'll get a perpendicular line from A to meet the line F O at G. So at G we bisect the angle AGO to extend, extend the line to meet the line AO at H. So after bisecting it, the line will meet line AO at H with the center at O and the radius OH will describe a circle which will be the point, the midpoint for the other remaining circle as a reference to other points. So now, with the center of our compass at H and the radius AH will describe the required circle. So with this circle, we use it to reproduce other circles by bisecting the angle between each point that's like bisecting the angle between b and c to get the other point then do that at c then at d and also at e after doing this we'll have the required number of circles within another large circle which is what we are to do today which is required so thank you for watching this video ensure to subscribe to this channel for more videos thank you